everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today, let's continue the journey through the 2024 NBA Mock Draft. From picks 21 to 30, who will emerge as the next wave of talent set to make an impact in the league? Let's begin. No. 21. New Orleans Pelicans via Bucks. Eve Missy, center from Baylor. The Pelicans are likely to be active this summer as they work on shaping their roster around Zion Williamson, in addition to potentially acquiring a playmaker and considering a trade involving Brandon Ingram, New Orleans might look for a new center to replace free agent Jonas Valanciunas. Eve Missy presents an intriguing option. Although he lacks the floor spacing typically desired in a partner for Williamson, he could make an immediate impact as a rim runner, providing paint protection and the agility needed to defend pick and roll situations. No. 22. Phoenix Suns. Kyle Filipowski, power forward center from Duke. While it's far from certain, the Suns desperately need this pick to yield a ready-to-contribute player for their highly top-heavy team. Kyle Filipowski appears to be one of the safer choices available. Though he may lack the physical attributes to become a star, he could enhance Phoenix's offense with his shooting, post-creation, and finishing abilities while also providing greater defensive mobility compared to the Suns' current starting center Yusuf Nurkic. Number 23, Milwaukee Bucks, via Pelicans, Tyler Smith, power forward from League Ignite. The Bucks will always seek to maximize their spacing as long as Giannis Antetokounmpo is in Wisconsin. Tyler Smith could be an ideal addition, offering Milwaukee another shooter while standing at 6'9 with a 7.1 wingspan. Although he may only develop into a role player, the Bucks faced with the challenge of finding consistent support players and limited acquisition options due to their luxury tax constraints, would be thrilled to turn this pick into a reliable shooter with strong defensive capabilities. Number 24, New York Knicks via Mavericks, Terrence Shannon Jr., shooting guard, shooting forward from Illinois. Terrence Shannon Jr. is difficult to project in the draft due to his legal situation. A June 10th court date following a May 10th hearing on first degree felony rape and felony aggravated sexual battery charges might provide more information but it's uncertain how teams will perceive him by draft night. From a strictly basketball perspective, he brings a bit of everything, including athleticism, quick strike scoring, and defensive potential. Number 25, New York Knicks, Zach Eady, center from Purdue, the Knicks currently have no opening at center, but that could change soon. Both Isaiah Hartenstein and Precious Akua are set to become free agents. If the Knicks decide to invest significantly in one of them, potentially giving Hartenstein a costly new contract, they might need to move on from Mitchell Robinson and his eight-figure salary. Should New York find themselves needing a center, Drafting Zach Eady could be an intriguing option. Standing nearly 7 per war with an almost 7 ton 11 wingspan, Eady is highly skilled around the basket as a post scorer, rebounder, and rim protector. Gnome 26, Washington Wizards, via Clippers, Pacomi Dadiet, shooting forward, power forward from Ratio Farm Ulm. If upside isn't the focus in Washington's draft room, the Wizards are missing the mark. In the early stages of their rebuild, they need to take bold risks to begin forming a solid foundation. The draft occurs before Pacom Daddy its 19th birthday, underscoring the significant potential for growth in the young French swingman. Kevin O'Connor of The Ringer noted Daddy its raw go-to scoring upside, while Jonathan Wasserman highlighted his shooting versatility, play finishing, and brief on-ball flashes. There's a lot to like here, especially for a franchise that should be as patient as this one. Number 27. Minnesota Timberwolves, Kevin McCuller Jr. Shooting guard, shooting forward from Kansas. The Timberwolves recently won 56 games and reached the Western Conference Finals with two of their top four rotation players, Anthony Edwards, 22, and Jaden McDaniels, 23, being under the age of 24. Unless there are significant trades this summer, they have every reason to believe they'll be back in the championship hunt next season. In that case, they'll want an early contributor, and Kevin McCullough Jr. fits the bill, 
provided his late season injuries at Kansas don't persist. His three-point shooting is a question mark, but that might be the only uncertainty beyond his medical status. No. 28. Denver Nuggets. Darren Holmes 2. Center from Dayton. Can the Nuggets find a legitimate backup for Nikola Jokic? Absolutely. If the draft board falls in their favor. Darren Holmes 2, though not towering at 6'9 and 236 LBs, plays larger than his size as a shot blocker and rebounder while also contributing offensively with his shot making abilities. According to Wu, Holmes recently canceled several workouts, raising strong suspicions that he has secured a guarantee in the latter part of the first round. Number 29, Utah Jazz via Thunder, Bobby Clintman, shooting forward, sharp power forward from Cairns tie pants. The Jazz could play it safe here, but why should they? With the Western Conference potentially being as competitive as ever next season and coming off a 51 loss season, Utah is far from contending. Therefore, they could take a chance on upside by selecting Bobby Clintman. At 6'9", Clintman has the potential to become a highly coveted big wing who can stretch the defense, score in transition, and defend multiple positions. Number 30, Boston Celtics, Carlton Carrington, point guard charge shooting guard from Pittsburgh. Boston might have the best roster in basketball, allowing the front office considerable flexibility in the draft. While they could prioritize finding a center, selecting one of the remaining bigs at this point might be a reach. Instead, the Celtics could strengthen their backup backcourt with Carlton Carrington, a combo guard who carries that label not due to a poor fit, but because of his potential to excel in both scoring and playmaking roles. As we conclude our journey through the 2024 NBA Mock Draft, from pick 21 to 30, keep your eyes on these rising talents as they prepare to make their mark in the league. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe for more updates on the latest draft projections and NBA insights. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.